Well, guys, what do you think we um, fire up Photoshop and try and improve an ocean liner? What do you guys want? What do you guys, what are you thinking? What ship are we going to improve? The Oriana? No, come on. Really? The Oriana? That's like the third Oriana I've seen. Maybe I will have to do the Oriana. There's another Oriana. All right, well, I guess we're fixing the Oriana. Okay. Nope, didn't want to do that. <laughs> I mean, uh, really? You really want me to fix this thing? Look at it, it's so pretty. Just so you know, I already love the Oriana, okay? This is like, I have such a deep, deep affection for this ship, so let's do it. Okay, so what we're gonna do, I guess, if I had to fix anything, it would be these kind of silly looking funnels. So we're gonna get rid of this real quick, make the sky look a little less unnatural. Um, okay, so what I'm thinking, what I'm thinking is we, we take that flying bridge and bring that and put that in a more traditional spot, right? So we're gonna put it like around here. And, and I, even, I love the windows beneath it as well. I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna put it about there, okay? Um, you know what? This is purely for aesthetics, okay? So yeah, we're deleting some cranes. <laughs> we're, we're hampering the, the function of this ship uh, significantly, but we are making it just look better. That's all we're trying to do. So that's already starting to look a little a little more like your traditional liner. I know, I know how to make you all happy. It's just to make any ship that looks a little unorthodox look like I should just, you know what? I know how to, I know how to make this look. Here's, here's what, I know this is what you guys want. I know this is what you want. This is all I need to do. There we go. <laughs> tell me that's, tell me that's not what you wanted me to do from the start. That's all I needed to do. Done. Done. Well guys, this has been great fun. I hope you've enjoyed the stream. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. I knew you'd like this. Look at this. I knew it. I'm just seeing a million comments. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. I knew this is what you guys would would, uh, would want to see. I promise. I promise when this is done, we will actually go and make this look like a normal, a normal ship, right? I feel like I'm committing a crime doing this. This is terrible. This is how I spend my time. I can't believe you've done this. <laughs> now the Oritanic is good, um, but we are, I, I set out, I set out to improve the Oriana. By Jingo, I'm gonna do it. So, all right, that's enough of this rubbish. Where's the, let's get rid of these funnels. No, we are gonna, we are gonna fix this. Um, there was one P&O ship that had the prettiest funnels of all time. And that's the SS Iberia. So I wonder if we can find a color photo of Iberia and give her Iberia's funnels. That's a little more like it, huh? Oh yeah, that'll do. Look at this. Oh, that's good. That's good. Okay. So we're gonna cut out Iberia's funnel here. Put it behind Oriana. Maybe scale them down a little. So she had like kind of one there. And then maybe like a second one. Oh, it does still kind of look misproportioned, huh? I don't think. Hang on. Wait a minute. No, hang on. I'm not done with the placement here. Don't don't crucify me for doing this just yet. Yeah. Okay. Traffic cone. They're pretty. Come on. Hey. Hey. Listen. Don't don't you guys start making fun of Iberia. That is a that is a beautiful looking ship. That is a beautiful ocean liner. Come on. No. It just looks like a container ship now, with with funnels. And that just looks cursed. Gee. Three funnels doesn't work. What do you think it is? Are they two? It's like they're too small. You need like, <sighs> they need to be bigger, like fatter maybe. Oh, that's a little better. Yeah. Maybe, mm. this is tricky. Mm. Still not quite, still not quite. And I think it may be this bridge that's kind of throwing me off. Like that needs to be there. That needs to be there. Okay. They look like lighthouses. All right, maybe, maybe Iberia's funnels just weren't the right choice. I thought this would look really good. In my mind, it looked really good. In reality, though. No, that looks terrible. Um, oh, what's going on? Why doesn't this work? That should work, right? Does it just need... Oh, that looks better. Huh? That looks a little better. All right. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Now it kind of looks like a sleek 
one of the, you know, like one of the German liners from the 30s a little bit. Um, I think what is also throwing me off is um, the aft superstructure here. So let's play around with this a little bit. That, we're going to step it down a little bit more. And make it just a little bit more um, elegant. Just got rid of that crane because, again, none of this is for functionality. This is purely for looks. I think chilling out the superstructure aft and stepping that has made it look nicer. Um, skinnier and taller. You want the funnels taller? You think? Like, oh, no, yeah, that actually does look better. Yeah, that does look nice. What we'll do is get rid of this as well. We'll just delete that. We'll put that like there, okay? So we knock off a whole layer of that wedding cake of a stern. I'm gonna take those, I'm gonna put those kind of like there just to continue some kind of little, that could be like an observation lounge kind of thing. Okay. Okay. I mean, I mean, you know, it's, it's not at all cohesive with the rest of the lineup for P&O of that era. Oh, my green screen is driving me nuts. Sorry. I, I, this... <laughs> That's done it. Now I don't have any hair. Sorry, I should have done that earlier. Nope. Nope. There we go. That's what I was looking for. <laughs> Say it with me, kids. It's not Notion Line and Design Stream. Unless something goes wrong. And do we need a radar mast? Do we need a radar mast? Let's um, let's see what that looks like. Um, let's take QE2's. Let's take QE2's radar mast. Hmm, that's the angle we want. I'm just gonna borrow part of this uh, part of this image. Whoops! <laughs> I kind of love it. I kind of love it. I, I really like it. I think we just accidentally cunartified. I didn't mean to do that. That's cool though. Although again, it just feels lazy. You can't just take like all of the QE2 and slap it on the Oriana. We're just taking the, the radar mast. No, we're sticking with our, our two funnel design because it's cool. All right, listen, look at that. <laughs> oh, now by comparison, this just looks bad. Oh, I'm still not thrilled with it. Do they need to be further apart? Oh, that's actually looking a little better. I think maybe they just need to be a little smaller. The funnels are driving me nuts. It's not quite right, you know? It's still not quite there, is it? This one's actually a little harder to do. Maybe I'll just delete a little bit more superstructure. <laughs> it's better, it's better, it's, it's getting there. We'll just kind of sell the illusion that this is actually just a deck house. Hmm, interesting. Again, actually, you know what? You know what? These uh, boats, I think I'm not very much enjoying their location. I think what we do is bring, give it a whole new promenade deck and bring those boats down. Maybe we try that. All right. Uh, now it just looks like one of the uh, Holland America ships, or like the, the Dutch ships of the, the 50s and the 60s. Okay, I, can, I can dig that. I think we're getting somewhere, guys. I think this is looking good. That after funnel can probably go back. Well, no, 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 don't do that. That can go back there, so it's sitting a little more on the deck house. That can go down a bit. You know what, guys? I think we fixed the Orion. <laughs> Original. Fixed. Original. Fixed. Kind of, kind of fixed. It's not, again, the funnels, they're still not quite right. I don't know if... Everybody likes the original better. This this has been a little um, a little contentious. This one. You know what? Maybe I think um, I'm not a big fan of white hulls. I'll be honest. Let's just quickly see what this looks like. Oh. Oh, now that's pretty. Come on, that looks like um, like the sister ship to Bremen or something, or or Europa. Huh? Come on, you can't deny that looks pretty now. Add wings? <laughs> this is just getting out of control now. Just because otherwise it just looks too much like one of the North German Lloyd ships. It's kind of cool. What if we gave it black funnel tops? I still think I liked it with the, um, with the golden funnel. Charles says, okay, I admit it. It's not as, it's not as bad as it could have been. 
please change the funnel color to crimson red? Then it's just going to look like French line. Yeah, see? It's like the SS France 3. <laughs> nah. Nah. I'm purist. Sorry. That's it. Done. Done. Oriana? Um, I don't think we improved it. I just think we made it look different. Original? After. Original? After. Yeah, that's literally just a North German Lloyd ship. Okay. <laughs> it is the Oriana! What's, what would be the German equivalent of Oriana? D Oriana. Yeah. Genau. Oh, yeah. Actually, oh, maybe that would look cool. Like one of those old signs they used to do back in the day. There we go. The Oriana. Mm. Es ist ausgezeichnet. <laughs> this has been a lot of fun. I'm glad we, we did this again. This is good. I actually, the more I look at this, the prettier it gets. I'm, I'm a big fan of this ship. I think it's good. The bridge still needs a refit. Okay, maybe next time. Nothing beats the Oritanic. Yeah, you're right. Well, <laughs> I guess we'll end on the Oritanic. I'm going to um, put this in full screen. No, that's too ugly. I'm going to put this in full screen. <laughs> and I'm going to disappear off screen. Have a wonderful holiday, guys. See you again.